Hi, my name is Alex Stevenson and I would like to thank the OMRF and the Aotearoa Gaming Trust for funding my scholarship this year. This is Kevin. Kevin has schizophrenia, which means he experiences hallucinations, such as voices, which you and I cannot hear. But what causes these hallucinations? In the brain, most people have normal functioning pathways. However, in schizophrenia, one of these pathways are very overreactive. Kevin takes antipsychotics to treat his schizophrenia. Antipsychotics work by dampening down this overreactive pathway and provide normal function again. This means Kevin's hallucinations will go away, leaving him to lead a normal life. However, there are side effects to these antipsychotics, most notably dizziness, nausea and a tremor. Over time, they also experience weight gain, which can lead to a whole bunch of other issues. Additionally, one third of people don't respond to their medications, leaving them to deal with their hallucinations. These side effects must be controlled with other medications. But could these other medications have an additive effect when treating schizophrenia? In this study, we're using many MRI scans from the UK Biobank to compare brain structures of people with schizophrenia between those on just antipsychotics and those on additional medications to treat antipsychotic side effects. If differences are found, these additional medications could be exploited to treat the one-third of schizophrenic patients currently resistant to their medications.